What up, y'all? It's your boy Marquise Infinity, man. I really never call myself that. I don't even like saying my name. But um, I thought I'd just introduce myself to y'all, let y'all know who I am, where I'm from, the stuff I like. Obviously, I probably know what I like. But just tell y'all about myself. Um, I got hyper problems, so you might see me just spin and do weird shit, but it's okay. So my name is Marquise infinity last name really paisley um shit i like music i like cartoons i like rap music i like fucking wrestling sonic and shit uh anime not too many anime though not in the weebo and none of that but just a couple like the stuff i grew up with then a couple that i started watching like I ain't gonna lie i tapped in the b stars you know tapped in a little bit but you know how it go all right and then um uh, what else I fuck with? I fuck with uh, Hunter Hunter, DBZ of course, all DBZs. Um, mm, Naruto Shippuden, Naruto Naruto Shippuden. I don't watch Boruto. It's just it's weird. It's just trash. I don't fuck with it. I gotta stop cussing, bro. That's my main thing. That's why I get flags and stuff. But um, yeah, I don't mess with that. Uh. I watched Clannad when I first graduated high school. I like it. I ain't gonna lie to you. The dude, uh, Tomoya, Tomoya, or Tomoyo, Tomoyo, he remind me of myself. Just the way he be thinking in his head. That's how I be thinking. Um, enough about specific stuff, though. Uh, wrestling, my favorite wrestler of all time. AJ Styles, I fuck with Kurt Angle, Randy Orton. I just like wrestlers that can do it all. That's why I really like AJ, because he could beat you up, flip, and he could, uh, Beat you up, flip, and he could uh, do technical stuff. So it was just like that. Chris Jericho like that, too. Just like wrestlers like that. They're my favorite. Like RVD. People that just ain't limited in one box. You know what I'm saying? Like that. Shit. Like Seth Rollins. He the same way for it. Um, where I'm from, from Detroit. Grew up in Detroit. Moved to Farmington after like 14 or 13 years in Detroit. And then, um... Graduated from North Farmington, then walked the stage. Tripping, man. The whole the hoes took over my brain when I got to ninth grade. The hoes took over my brain. I'm looking around at all these hoes because I was in a DPS school. Um, you know, where you walk in the straight lines, follow the leader, kids, follow the leader. Don't don't get out the line. And I go to a Dearborn Heights public school. You can walk out, you got lockers. You can pick what you want to eat. I'm like, bro, this is motherfucking the best, the best shit I've ever been to. Summer school, my first year, F, 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 F. Chasing Mexican hoes, Arabic hoes. It was just all bad for me. But anyways, oh, yeah, that messed me up so bad that I was just messed up. So, like, I don't know. I was an honor student in Detroit, but then when I got to, like, out there with, like, everybody else just, I just lost my mind. I just too much freedom for me, though. It was too much freedom. My brain couldn't rationalize. I didn't know how to talk to people without, you know, guidelines and shit. I was messed up. But um, let me see what else. Went to North Farmington. Um, it was a great school. Probably my favorite school I've been to. Graduated from there. Didn't walk the stage. Credits was terrible. Had to do summer school. I remember I told a nigga on the phone, like, I wasn't going to be able to, uh, I wasn't graduating. This nigga laughed. I'm like, damn. I mean, shit, you know what I'm saying? Just let me know who fuck with me, who don't fuck with me. But, hey, man, we on a whole nother level with this. So, I don't even know what I'm talking about. But you know what's going on. Y'all know. So, then, uh, I went to college, Western Michigan. Started making beats my girlfriend. Uh, I had a girlfriend at the time. We broke up. Some bullshit happened. It wasn't my fault. We broke up. Then I started making beats. I got FL Studio. I went to Guitar Center, bought that. Tapped in, locked in with FL Studio making beats. Uh was so locked in with it that I just left school. I was like, bro, I'm done with that. I don't wanna do it no more. Um, plus I wasn't even going to class. I was staying from class making beats on the computer. We had a uh, I had a roommate, but he was like in the back room. Every time he come out, he see me on the computer. Move this here, and, you know what I'm saying? I was locked in. I was big as hell, wasn't getting no sleep. Um, yeah, man. Yeah.
I had a pop up on the computer, so it kind of messed my brain up. I, I think I got ADHD, but I don't know if I really got it. But I can focus if I really need to. That's why I be just moving so much and stuff like that. Um, what else? All right, so college left college, came back to the crib. Um, then after that, um, I decided to really lock in with the music shit. I, I thought that I had it. Of course, you think you got it when you first start off with the beats. You like, hey, you know, uh. I got these beats for you. Niggas was rapping on them, though, but, like, it wasn't doing them for real. Like, so, uh, I decided to go to engineering school in Chillicothe, Ohio. It's called the Recording Workshop. That's where I learned how to mix and all my stuff. I mean, I don't really be mixing heavy on my music just because I know, like, what I like. You know what I mean? But I know how to mix guitars and all that pan shit out. And, you know what I mean? I know them big words and stuff, but it's just, like... Niggas don't care about that. Niggas just want to hear you on the beat. And if you sweet, if you not sweet, they turn it off. But, yeah. So, I came back from school. Got a job. Uh, as a uh, Got a job in the kitchen as a dietary assistant. Uh, serving old people in the old folks' home. They was fuck with me. They like, you're a handsome man. Where's your girlfriend? I'm like, I don't know. I was lying to one of them. Like, yeah, I got a girl just so he can stop asking, man. It was... Every day, I'm like y'all niggas weird as hell. No oh, old white people, but they was cool. And like when they see, when they could, it shouldn't even be like that. But it, it's crazy. Like when they see that you like talk back, they be like, "Oh, this guy's not bad," you know. I see. They think I'm. This is just my regular face right now. I'm walking through like this. They probably think I'm ready to swing on them. You know what I'm saying? But after they start talking to me, they see how my my tone of voice is and stuff. They're like, "Oh, he cool. He cool." When I move, I breathe hard. And when you feel like I'm 400 pounds, where is that? Okay, so I got that job in the kitchen. Uh, I make, then I start, decided to just start rapping on my own shit. Dropped my first CD, which was called uh, Forever, I think. Forever was my face on the cover. Dropped that bitch. It, it was cool. People liked it. But then, after that, I'm like, what I'm going to do? For some reason, I had the sample from... Um, I don't know why I'm so happy. I'm sad, but I'm not happy. I'm sad. I forgot what the name is. Um, um, Chain Reaction. The nigga made Chain Reaction. And, um, Lotus Flower Bomb. Michael Franks. I, I had a Michael Franks sample chopped up on my computer. Um, I don't know why I'm so happy. And then for some reason, I just made the beat. And I'm like, bro, I'm not going to just say anything. So I started talking about porn stars. I started about like Arab, all of them. You can look up. It's called Me Hub and You. It's on my uh, SoundCloud. Wrapped on that, people were sharing, and I made a, uh, 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 what is it called? It's not, uh, a video where you like to, what is it called? I'm a memory ass, look, I want to fight myself. I want to just hit myself in the head with a fucking grenade launcher or something. But, um, it's not Twitch, Twitch is online streaming. What is it called? It's called, uh, damn. It was what everybody was using back in the day when you made trailers. I had made a trailer. Um, and then... Yeah, I made a trailer, uh, posted it on Instagram. Niggas was resharing it. I ain't pay nobody to do nothing. And the hoes following me like, hey, I like you and stuff. I'm like, you don't even know me so much you like me. That's how I, it showed me there, right there. Like, nigga, you doing this off of this. This is made if I walk on stage or something. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, it was what it was. So, uh, after that, uh, I just started making all silly songs from there on out. Because I was like, fuck it. I'm going to be myself. Goofy as hell. But witty, you know. They gonna dive too deep into my uh to my my chapter and shit. Y'all can do that if y'all want to. Just watch my shit. And I don't know. That's how I do. I dissect shit. And the reason I ain't bagging back on bagging back because I just got drawers on. I'm gonna put my pants on and go to work. Um, where was that? So, um, making the silly songs. And then I drop uh some auto tune shit called Old Eight Oids because I fuck with Eight Oids and Heartbreak. My favorite like auto tune CD. Yeah, that shit changed my life. I was playing Naruto, uh, Uzumaki Chronicles. The no, I don't know what it was. The uh, the one on Xbox Three Sixty. I was playing that. It's a motherfucking Robocop and all them songs and shit. Um, then after that, um, I started recording basketball videos. My page is Clubhouse Hoops on Instagram, YouTube. You can check me out. I do mixtapes. Come up, pull up, film you, chop up the videos. Uh, put out reviews on the players. Detroit, like, the city tapped in with me for real with the basketball stuff. Like, I put in work. I sit at a game for 10 hours straight recording. 
chopping niggas clips up, posting them, boom, 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 just posting them, bam, bam, bam. Niggas like, bro, you work hard. Is it a team? I'm like, no, it's me. That's how I know, like, whatever I got, it, it, it helped me make stuff and it helped me be creative. So, start putting that in the music and I jump on TikTok. Boom. I'm like, let me just drop all my songs on there. Niggas start tapping into the TikToks. Start going, you know. Start sharing it. People start laughing. I start doing wrestling songs, chopping that up. The one that really took me off was that Kurt Angle song. Niggas love that. And then I just start just going crazy. And I start doing the Sonic. I'm about to wrap it up. Kanye see me speeding up with it. Because, you know, I'm about to get ready to go. You know what I'm saying? But, um, <laughs> but yeah, I start doing the Sonic songs and shit. Niggas start sharing that. And here we are today at, what, 4,000 followers, almost 4,100, probably there now. But, yeah, I just wanted to give y'all a little feedback to my story. I can go even deeper, but I got to go to work. And I'm not trying to get fired, so I'm going to see y'all, boys. If y'all want more videos and me just, you want Instagram, I'm talking about Instagram, you want YouTube videos, you want videos of me on the computer with screens and shit, you know how people be like, all right, this is what I do. And, you know, if you want stuff like that, just let me know, bro, because I can do it, but I got to know if y'all want it, because I don't want to do it if and niggas don't want it. I ain't about to waste my time. I right, just make the songs. Help me blow up. Help me blow up. And I'm going to keep giving y'all niggas what y'all want. I love y'all so much, because y'all really motivate me to keep going anyway. You know what I'm saying? Y'all niggas be pushing me. Time I'm going to start rap, stop rapping because this shit. But now I'm going to just keep going, and keep going, and keep going, and never stop. I love y'all. I love y'all niggas, man. I almost felt a booger. I ain't no booger. That's just a light. But I love y'all, man. I hope all y'all get success where y'all want to be in life. And we going to take off. This is just all real and cut raw. I'm out of here. I got to go to work. I'm going to be late. But had to make this video. How do I stop? Do I do this? I got to come up with something I'm going to do. I ain't even like that, man. I'm done.